Well, we didn't skip it, I just didn't see it. Mm, hook me up with that hot sake. Another painting. What happened to the Huntress? Well, so impressed was the Lord of the Dead that he put her back together and made her his queen. Time and again he killed her, just to take pleasure in her proud refusal to be dead. But they say she's never stopped trying to claw her way back to the world of the living, where she knows she truly belongs. Isn't that a great story? Her courage is what inspired me to seek my own freedom. <laughs> she sounds like one hell of a woman. Yep. Oh, do you guys remember this one? Um, famous painter, famous painter. I can't remember his name. I did learn about him in school. Seventh Circle Violence. Violence? Uh, it's about that guy that, like, ate his baby or something like that. But that's like a, you know, like a demon version of it, but... Ah, oh, that's gonna bug the shit out of me that I can't remember that guy's name. I wanna say Van Gogh, but no, no. Is that Van Gogh? No, Van Gogh drew, like, like him missing an ear and shit. He was crazy. I'm sure someone will put in the comments, Oh, I know what painting you're talking about, and then I'll thank you because I can't remember. God, that's bugging the shit out of me that all those years of art classes I can't even remember. Psychopomp and circumstance. It was her turn <sighs> this to is fetch bootleg. the water, and Maris Grimm was determined to be done with it as soon as possible. Bucket in hand, she made her way down to the well by the wheat field. She and her two elder sisters were all beautiful, but on this windy day, Maris outshone them all. She was in love. Whoosh. The wheat bowed a greeting as the breeze caught it. And a good day to you, Maris giggled as her nipples responded to the weather and thoughts of her lover. My oh, word, what is this storybook rated? <clears throat> She wound a pail of water to the top of the well, but no sooner had she grabbed the rope than she felt a sharp tug, lost her balance, and went tumbling into the gloom head first. Mother Fudge! Mother Fudge! cried Maris. Yeah, if you haven't noticed, this is the story of the, uh, the, uh, the Sisters Grimm. An hour later, the sun sat lower in the sky as two figures approached the well. One was Maris's older sister, Colleen, and she was very concerned. The other was their faithful collie, Ow Ow. Help me! <laughs> cried Maris from the bottom of the well. But as Colleen grabbed the rope to pull her sister up, she too was yanked into the darkness below. Well, that sucks. Next page. Ow Ow, go get help, boy! cried Colleen. Oof! Woofed Ow Ow in response, but because he was a stupid collie, he instead grabbed the loose end of the rope and began to tug valiantly. <laughs> he was trying to save her. Crack Bam! Boom! 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 Suddenly, a freak bolt of lightning lanced down from the sky and hit poor Ow Ow, causing the pooch to explode in a crimson blossom of slippery Ow Ow giblets. Poor stupid Ow Ow. Stupid, right. fucked up. My pet was smarter. Shh, keep breathing. It was well after dark, and Maris and Colleen had all but given up hope when their eldest and wisest sister, Giltine, arrived on the scene. Where are you, sister? It was all she managed to utter ere she slipped on Ow Ow's unctuous leftovers and fell down, down, down into the wicked well. Plonkety rascal rabbitness. And with that, the sisters Grimm vanished from the world for seven full years. That fucking sucks, doesn't it? <laughs> when they returned, they served a new master who had been smitten by their beauty. Though that beauty faded, his gift to them was theirs forever. The power to end lives as abruptly as fate had ended their own. The end. Oh, I was hoping we'd find out why they all sound like men. <laughs> ah. Okay, so Fleming felt bad for him and hooked him up. That still doesn't explain why they all sound like men. And the wind is blowing hard. 
Do you think they will ever write a book about us, Johnson? Honestly, I see you as more of a comic book hero. And anyway, it just so happens I've already been immortalized in prose. Really? What is this book called? Big Bullocks and the Sixty <laughs> Testicles. Ah, oh, that's sorry, gross. <laughs> All right, so I guess we can start doing these doors one by one. Uh, hit him with that juice. Hmm. All right, ammo is in that one. <laughs> nine boxes. There's like eight or nine boxes and just one thing of ammo. Oh shit, that had none. This one had red gem in it. And that juice drink. Let's see, next area. Upgrades available. Let's put up that, uh, that, 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 uh, capacity. Oh, wrong. Fuck. I always do that. It's like, it doesn't take you to the right area sometimes. Hmm, that went well. Except for these three untouched boxes. Now, put the capacity. Oh fuck! Almost did it again. Cause like it, the what thing, what how I keep messing up is when you go to capacity and you press right, it brings you back to the damage. If that does that, then when you press left, it should bring you back to the capacity. That's where I keep screwing up at. And then I press left and then do it. And yeah. I don't know why I'm using the pistol. I should just be using this thing since I never use it. What the fuck was that? Uh oh, I thought that was like a body. Oh shit. Bitch, I'm not falling for that sexy bullshit. I'm only at half mast. Now you bring my angel out here before I get misad. misad on the. Fuck! As you can see it, big wide open area equals boss fight time. Third sister. Oh dear. This is gonna I fucking think the suck. <laughs> sister Grim is just a bit angry. We've thinned out her family. Here we go. Shit! The, oh fuck. To tell you the truth, I don't even remember this boss fight. So. Ah! So she red. God, all those bullets are just missing. So you can only attack her in. Oh! Okay, this isn't good. Retreat! Retreat! See, you should have. Get the fuck out of here. Oh! Fuck! Show your ass to me! Okay, so you shoot her in the face to unveil her weak spot, which is her chest, which you can only attack at night. And this weapon is practically useless right now because the spread is so big. Whatever, I can still squeeze that face. Okay, here we go. Skull fest time! Sucks how she starts like floating. Yeah, I know that's done. Right, more ammo over there. Head is itching. Okay, go. Put your sip on. Ah! Right, back up. What the? Gave me up. Stupid slut. Gave up here. Shit. Oh. Oh, fuck. 
I was like trying to roll. Okay, here we go. Just taking it in the face. 